You are about to discover the fastest way to give your SharePoint 2010 sites a new design. You will make your team and your boss say, wow, even if you haven't got the technical skills or you are a SharePoint newbie. You'll find out that the expert that you thought that you needed is totally redundant and you could be minutes from saving hundreds or even thousands of dollars. Stop wasting time and money on designers and expensive consultants. Instead, you will see a tactic that will make you the expert. And it's so simple. Just copy and paste and you're done. Does your team have expectations of fast delivery of SharePoint sites and everyone is looking at you? This is your chance to step up and get recognized as a person that delivers stunning, cool-looking sites. So, your boss and team are waiting right now. Stop wasting time. Hey, and don't worry. If you don't like this product, or people don't like the designs that you buy, or you run into any problems that our fantastic support can't solve for you, I'll give you your money back. Now let's jump into a short demo of the software. If you scroll way down on this page, there's going to be an Add to Cart button and a link there. So I'll press that. I will be taken to a checkout process. So after you go through the checkout process and pay securely for the product, you will be redirected back to the site where you will have instant access to the membership site. Within the membership site, you will have access to the zip files and the designs, and that's the most important thing. And the second part is the modules. That's where you can learn the different tactics to implementing the design. Most of these are not known to most SharePoint consultants. You will be way ahead of your colleagues. How cool is that? Module 1 will show you how to create an environment for testing so that you get this right. If you don't have a live environment you're going to implement design in, or you don't have a virtual instance of SharePoint where you can test out things, then you'll be shown easily how to create a free environment in the cloud where you can break stuff before you master the tactics. You can test how it works before you go ahead and implement it on your own live site. Module 2 is going to show you how you can control the master page within SharePoint. This is going to show you how you can use SharePoint Designer 2010 to copy files into SharePoint and update the whole design. The third video in Module 2 is going to show you how to alter the design you bought to make it your own. And the third module is just to show you how you can easily use the third method to copy the SharePoint design into your SharePoint sites only using the browser and nothing else. And finally, I want to show you on a live SharePoint site exactly what it is that you will be able to do. So this is a SharePoint team site, out-of-the-box site with the ribbon and everything, and I want to change the look and feel of that. So you are going to take one of my packages with the design in, and you're going to update it with a folder with images. Then take the style sheet, save that, go back to the site, and refresh. Bam! That was easy. Did you see how it changes the whole site? Want to try another one? Let's pick this package, and once again you're going to copy the folder with images and the style sheet like this. Hit save and go back to the browser and refresh the site. BAM! Once again the site has completely changed. Really easy to do, and it looks great. Scroll down the page and hit the Add to Cart button, and I'll see you on the other site where our SharePoint instructor is waiting to teach you how to do this. See you on the other site.